Thanks for checking out this video about SharePoint Implemented's Department Template. Let's get right into it. Hi, this is me. I'm Keith, and I'm the manager of the HR department, and this is my department's homepage. And this is Lindsay. She's a recruiter who works for me. We're a small department, but we're growing pretty fast. We have two job fairs to go to in the next few days, and we're planning on hiring a few talented people to make our department grow. In fact, we just hired a guy yesterday. His name is Andrew, and here is his resume. It's pretty convenient to keep files centralized like this. This way, my associate Lindsay and I can stay in sync much, much better. For this job fair coming up, I have a few things to put in place. First, I'm going to announce to the whole company that Lindsay and I will both be out of the office. I'll just go up here to the announcements box and click this plus sign to create a new item. I just fill in the message here and I click on the post domain checkbox. Post domain means that I not only want the entry to show up on the department's announcement box, but I also want it on the main company internet homepage announcement box. Here's the entry on my department's page, and here it is on the main company internet homepage. Very nice. Now, let me go back to the department page again. You know what? Our department page has a lot of cool things on it like a place to put documents in a security restricted area, an open issues list just to make sure nothing falls through the cracks, a more formal task list so I keep up to date on things daily, and a place to even store discussions and emails. There's even a thing up here to visualize our major department goals in a chart-like fashion. I've even got two areas for links. Over here is a side menu that'll show up on every page in this department site, and this set of links over here, which will show up on only this page. Adding any item to any of these little widgets is super simple. I just click on these green plus signs, but there are other options. Like for this discussions and emails list, I could connect it to my Outlook. Here's my Outlook inbox, and I just drag and drop the email items I want to copy into here. This is mapped directly into the SharePoint discussions and emails list. And what a great feature this is for archiving emails that are relevant for the whole team to see in the future. So there's a million cool things that I can show you like the global top nav bar. Not only do we in the HR department have our own SharePoint presence, but so does the product development department. And I hear the sales department is working on their side as well. That's all I have time for right now, but I hope you got a little taste of how our department works smoother now that we have a centralized platform for communication and files and task management. Anyway, I've got to go back to preparing for the job fair now. Lindsay's waiting for me. Thanks for tuning in. Check out SharePointImplemented.com for more details. Goodbye.